I think you'd have to go back way, way back and look with a microscope to find something wrong with Linda McMahon. Like I said, the way she handled the charity work back in the day and the way that she took the WWF to the WWE to the worldwide organization. You know, since I started wrestling, I wrestled in every state in the union, every province in Canada, in 30 different countries. It's unbelievable the appeal of wrestling around the world, you know. Yeah. That's why I like to joke with the NFL guys. I'm like, world champions, <laughs> where in the world do you fellas go? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. So I want to ask you about this because we know that millions went to vote on November 5th and they voted for policies. Overwhelmingly, people voted for the candidate they believe will make this country safer. And you've had firsthand experience of just how unsafe this country has become. I understand you had your home broken into back in 2022 and had to hold the intruder at gunpoint until local police could arrive. Could you tell me a little bit about that? And what do you make of this spike in crime throughout the country? Well, I think the big spike in crime is, has to do a lot with the illegal aliens that are coming across the border. I mean, I get to travel all over the world. I was just up in New York City for the New York City Comic Con. And it's not the New York City I remember. You yeah. know, my sister from a small town in upstate New York, she used to come down and see the Christmas lights and everything on a bus. The whole bus quit coming down to uh, New York City. Mm -hmm. So I think that has a lot to do with it. But, yeah, I did have a home intruder. I had to hold him at gunpoint. It was uh, quite an exciting time, tell you the truth, because uh, I live out in the country to have somebody break into my home yeah. uh, and actually have a gun in my hand and tell somebody, don't move or I will shoot you. Uh, <laughs> It I was, would say uh, that and thank intruder. goodness the police, the police and sheriff's department did a great job. And uh, thank goodness everything ended, ended well. Yeah, I would say that intruder definitely picked the wrong home to break into <laughs> that day coming face up. to face with you. you. There's still a little bit of old hacksaw in here. Ho! <laughs> yes, I love it. You know, I was going to ask you to do that and I didn't even have to ask. I love it. So I know that you had such a long career in the WWE. So before you go, I just... I want to ask you about some of your favorite memories from your wrestling days, uh, spanning back decades. What do you miss the most? Yes, yes ma'am. You know, I'm from a small town in upstate New York called Glens Falls. And my dad used to bring me and my sisters to Madison Square Garden to see the circus every once in a while. So who, my dad, who was my best man in my wedding, we were very, very close, glad bless him, to have him with me driving to New York City pull up in front of Madison Square Garden and see Hacksaw Jim Duggan versus Andre the Giant. It was a thrill of a lifetime. And no matter what profession you're in, you sell out the garden, you sell out the garden. We sold out the garden and Andre beat the devil out of me. <laughs> <laughs> That's so incredible. And we saw Donald Trump uh, essentially sell out the garden just a few days before he was elected. Yes, ma'am. And, you know, of course, uh, Donald Trump is very active in wrestling. Back in the day, we had WrestleMania in Atlantic City at the Trump Plaza. And, of course, the famous hair versus hair with Vince McMahon. So, uh, Mr. Trump, President Trump, excuse me, <laughs> he's been around wrestling for a while. Absolutely. Um, before I let Had you go, anything... I love this. You know, I could talk to you all day, Hacksaw Jim, as long as I can call you Hacksaw you. Jim. Um, I uh -huh. want to ask you again, anything else you want to add about Linda McMahon? Because so many people don't know her. The only the only person they know is the person they see on TV or ringside at the WWE. Mm -hmm. But any special tidbit that you want to share with us about her? Yeah, the, yes, uh, the Linda McMahon you see on TV is so much different than the Linda McMahon you, you deal with professionally. You know, a whole lot different than Hacksaw Jim Duggan is on TV than I am now. So Linda McMahon, she's a Im very impressive woman. President Trump could have made a better choice, and I'm proud to have known her. Awesome. Thank you so much, Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Please come back. You are a friend of the show now. Please come back again and join us. Loved it.